Look at that. Who dresses like that? The kid's got like a plunger on his head. That looks like half of a boob. And then he's got this weird belt and high socks. Kids don't dress like that. What kid wears a plunger on their head? Oh, hi everyone. <laughs> How's it going? Uh, welcome to Friday. Uh, we started off today, we're actually helping um, one of my friend's mothers, uh, she's uh, doing a children's book, and we actually spent uh, quite a bit of time this morning over there helping her out, and uh, it's looking good. It's looking really, really good. It's a really, it's a funny, it's a true story, um, and she had an artist illustrate this children's book, and she's come up with stuff, and we basically did some Photoshop work for her, and it's looking good, so I'm, I'm pretty excited about that. Uh, when it's finally done, I'll be sure to let you guys know, because uh, I think it'll be on Amazon where you guys can actually see it or, or buy it. So, anyway, uh, moving on to what we're going to be doing today, uh, I don't really know. My parents called me and was like, hey, you want mushrooms? And I'm like, what? Because <laughs> it was my dad that called. I'm like, what do you want? He's like, mushrooms. We're going to have mushrooms. Stuffed mushrooms. And I'm like, okay. Are you inviting me to dinner? Because this is a weird way to do it. And he's like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We want you to come over and have stuffed, stuffed mushrooms. And I was like, okay, sure. So apparently, since we're already out and about, we're going to go over to my parents' house. And it's about dinner time anyway. And we're going to have stuffed mushrooms. And that's it. Um, also, I believe we, we probably have enough mail. So we're probably going to run up to the mail uh, the mailbox, the post office and get the mail and then maybe later tonight we'll be shooting a Steven mail. But uh, yeah, things are going things are going good otherwise. You ever have one of those days where like, it's not that the whole lot's going on, it's not that you've accomplished a ton, it's just it feels like a good day. Because today is one of those days for me, it just feels like a good day. It's like, man, it's a good day, the sun's shining. You know, it's not that we've, we've done a whole lot. I mean, we helped her out a lot, which was good. But you know, as far as doing productivity stuff for ourselves or getting stuff done. It's not that we've done any of that. It's just, it feels like a good day. Do you agree with me? Yeah. Do you kind of feel like what I'm feeling right now? Yeah. It just feels like a good uh -huh. day. Like I could climb up in a tree with an apple and just eat it. I would never do that, but you know, if I did, it would be good too. Now that is a delicious looking mushroom. What's, what's all in this? Just so I know. Spinach. Sun-dried tomatoes, feta, mozzarella. And normally, it's supposed to have work jokes. And garlic. And balsamic. And balsamic. And balsamic. On it's pretty delicious. That we remember. My, uh, my mom had made these mushrooms, and she told us when we walked in the door, she's like, I'm thinking of also doing either black bean burgers or hamburgers. Which one do you want? And I'm like, well, aren't we each getting mushrooms? She's like, mm-hmm, that's the appetizer. And I said, it's not an appetizer if we each get a mushroom. Look at that thing. The thing's huge. Plus, we have this stuff. So, no, there's really no need for a burger. And I've had these before. They are super fantastic. We should make these. We've never tried making these ourselves. We could handle it. Hey, bud. Look, it's a sheet. He's like, yes, it's a sheet. There we go, bud. I mean, he loves it. <laughs> Just don't hit him into a chair. Yeah. Don't, don't do so well. Oh gosh, don't make him throw up. Don't get real wild with it because he'll try to jump out. Hey bud. Hey bud. I like the sheep. Hey. You having fun, buddy? He's like, yeah, this is all right. He's like, he's like a G.I. Joe trying to grow out. Yeah, um, we discovered Rocco would do this ever since he was a kitten. We would go to make the beds, and uh, whenever we would go to, like, like wash the sheets and take the sheets off he would jump up onto the bed and he wanted to be rolled around and stuff and he's funny huh what you doing he's like hey what's going on <laughs> he's heavy he is heavy. <laughs> i don't think the last time we did this rocket was no, this I, heavy no, I don't think i'm so like either. man it's taking muscles to hold this sheet he's kind of Rocco. Now. Rocco. <laughs> Let's put him down. Let's see if he's if he's done. If he's done or not. I can hear him purring. Yeah, he's purring really hard. Want to do it again? A little more? He's like, well, if we're gonna do a little more. Let's just <laughs> do it. <laughs> like a kid on the playground. There you go. Like a kid on the playground. You like it, honey? Huh? <laughs> What's going on? I'm, I'm in the washing machine. <laughs> 
Oh. You had your chance to get out. You didn't want to. <laughs> He's so funny. Rocco. Have you had enough, bud? You had yeah. enough yet? You ready to get out? You good? You done? I mean, it's. I mean, look at it. It's complete. There he goes. No. Oh. Hey, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> he was just waiting until we definitely wouldn't get him. He's like, are they done with me? I'm out of here. The other thing I need to take care of while I'm over here is getting a haircut because it's been quite a while and my hair is getting ridiculous. So I'm gonna get a haircut while I'm. <laughs> Excuse me. Mm. Anyway, before I ended today, um, I wanted to ask you guys a question. Um, it's something that I've considered for a long time and I've thought about for a long time. And I just got a question recently on the Q&A that went out today, and it kind of confirmed my suspicions that we might need this. And you're like, okay, well, what is it? Okay, we are nearing a thousand days on the vlog. And that's fantastic. A lot of you have been watching for a long time. A lot of you have taken the journey and have seen all of the episodes. But what about someone who caught a few episodes and is like, hey, this seems cool. I, I want to get into this. But... They, they don't have time to take the journey, and they want to get in on the action, but they don't really know who me and Mal are, and they don't know what we do. They don't know our interests. They don't know the hidden jokes and the references in the vlog. Um, how do they get into this? We don't have an intro video. We don't have um, a video that introduces us to the vlog other than day zero, which is not a very good intro video after a thousand days. So I'm thinking that maybe um, in the very, very near future, after we've gotten past a thousand days, that it might be appropriate to make a video that is just a really basic rundown, kind of explains a few basic things and a few starting points, um, basically giving vlog days like, you know, hi, I'm Steven, this is Mal, tell a little bit about ourselves and say we've been doing this for over a thousand days now. If you want to join us, that would be great. If you want to know about this, watch day this. If you want to know about this, watch day this. And I've thought about that before because I'm like, you know, there's so many people that join up into watching the vlog, and a lot of them, um, from what I've seen, they watch for a little while. They might watch, you know, up to 100 days from when they start watching. And then they're like, you know what, I want to know what's going on back there. So then they start over at zero, and they work their way forward, and they take the journey. I mean, there was someone who was asking, what is the journey? There were a few people who asked that because they're new to the channel. They don't even know what that means. And um, there's all this terminology and stuff that's just, you know, it gets thrown around. And I think it would be a really good idea if we had just a really basic video that, you know, if someone came to the vlog, that it wasn't scary <laughs> for them, that they would be able to jump in and feel at home and they would be able to watch. So I think we're going to do that. Um, I guess what I want to ask you guys is, first, do you think that's a good idea? And number two, if it is a good idea, what information should me and Mao include in that vlog? What is it, um, what is the most basic vlog information that we need to give to people? What vlog day should we recommend? Obviously, 82 explains our relationship, 234 is the engagement, 620 is the, the wedding, these are vlog days I have to recount in comments all the time. But what is it, you know, what, what other stuff should we talk about? I'm going to leave that up to you guys, um, because I think that we need an introduction video. Not 100% sure about that, but I think once you get to, to a thousand videos and you're still coming out every day and more people are coming to the channel, might be a good time, because we're approaching 10,000 vlog subscribers, and, you know, these people are coming in and they don't have time to watch a thousand videos. They want to get in on the action, but they need your help. Anyway, um, with that, I'm actually going to go ahead and edit here. We have a pretty busy weekend. We helped um, my friend's mother today with that book. Tomorrow, we're actually going to Sam's first birthday party. Sam. Justin and Laura's son. Remember, he was born two days before our wedding. He is now one years old. One year old. I can't, you, you can't really put an S at the end of year if you're only one year old. He's now one year old. So he's having a birthday party tomorrow, so we're going over there. And then Sunday, we have lunch plans with someone. And then Monday is our anniversary. So bam, 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 bam. Crazy stuff. Also, um, tomorrow I'm meeting someone that um, I have talked to on Craigslist. We're buying a video game from them. We're buying an old Super Nintendo game in the parking lot of a Burger King. Five dollars for Capcom Super Super Shootout Soccer or something. So hopefully we won't get shot. But if we get shot, you'll know why. 
because we were trying to buy Super Nintendo games. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and as always, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we?